emerge. Today's episode, A New American Dream. What separates man from beast? No, it's not his ability to tap dance. It is his desire to build. After thermonuclear war, man's towering industrial marvels may no longer stretch to the heavens. It then falls on you and the ingenuity of your fellows to rebuild the America we hold dear. Get started with camps, the construction and assembly mobile platform. It's the workbench of tomorrow. Once established, your camp will not only provide you with much needed shelter, but also the means to satisfy your hunger, quench your thirst, and even treat infection. The essential pillars of survival. Expand your camp by scavenging resources or mining raw materials the old-fashioned way. Then, construct your home of the future. If your first home site is undesirable, use your handy camp to move it to a better location. With your home secure, you can now craft handmade ordnance at your leisure to give your altercations that personal touch. Or better yet, sell these homemade implements to your neighbors for profit. Remember, capitalism, it's the only thing keeping us from being communists. The world may have ended, but keeping up with the Joneses has not. Use those hard-earned profits to upgrade your dwelling. When your home looks important, you are important. Now you've learned how to forge the new American dream. You are completely prepared to rebuild the greatest nation in the world. Today's episode, Being a Better You. In life, we must each deal with the hand we are dealt, performing our assigned role to the best of our capacity. But after total atomic annihilation, you may find the hand you were dealt has been reshuffled. Yes, gone are the simple days of yesteryear. Now the common workman must also be a covert operative. The farmer, a master of the martial arts. The ice cream man, a nuclear physicist. How will you make sense of it all? Simple. Turn to your official vault tech training materials. With these powerful tools in hand, you'll learn to make the most of your natural abilities and better understand what makes you special. Use them to be the best you you can be, or someone even better. Your survival depends on it. With your future secure, share your newfound knowledge with others for great benefit. But remember, there's power in diversity. Sometimes who we are isn't a choice at all. In fact, at a particular point in your young life, you may notice that your body has begun going through certain unfamiliar changes. No, it's not puberty, it's mutation. Thanks to our old pal, radiation, your DNA has become more interesting. See here? You've now gained the unique abilities of a marsupial in exchange for a mild neurological impairment. Now you've learned how to be a better you. You are completely prepared to achieve your full potential in the role of your choosing. As a hand-picked resident of Vault 76, it is your duty to carefully review your Vault Tech provided films yearly to fully prepare for the day when you will emerge. Today's episode, Let's Work With Others, The Art of Cooperation. As you venture out into this new American frontier, 
you may find yourself a little lonely. Chin up there, sport. Your fellow Vault 76 dwellers will have emerged as well. Brave the new world together. But don't become too attached too quickly. When making new acquaintances, practice the art of nonverbal communication to gain that interpersonal edge. Remember, cooperation is the key to success. There's no I in nuclear wasteland. Employ these proven techniques and your camaraderie will blossom. In fact, you might just make some lifelong friends. Of course, not everyone will be quite so neighborly. Beware the clever ploy. In the event of catastrophe, search for opportunity. Should you find yourself alone once more, don't fret. Replacing those old friends with new, better friends is a snap. See? You're prepared for anything. Now you know the benefits of working with others. You are completely prepared for the world above with exciting new... Today's episode, Atomics for Peace. When you emerge from the comfort and safety of your vault, the world you know will have changed. Take your friendly old neighbor, Johnny. Rather than coming over to borrow a cup of sugar, he may now be coming over for murder. Worse still, he may not be alone. In this instance, your current defensive implement will not be enough to do the job. The time has come to seek out greater means of protection. Nuclear armament. That's right. Courtesy of your Uncle Sam, these wonders of the atomic age can be found right in your own backyard. But how does a fellow like you acquire nuclear launch codes, you may ask? Begin by inquiring with the locals. Gently coax them into cooperation. Use a little elbow grease if you have to. In the likely event you don't acquire a full code on your own, do not give up. Think back to the old saying, the enemy of your enemy is your friend search for others who might be harboring a grudge. You'll have that nuclear launch code in no time. With the power of the atom at your fingertips, be responsible and consider your target carefully. Will your bomb land on a rival camp of degenerates? A random stranger? The local wildlife? The choice is yours. Whatever your target may be, take advantage of the resulting fallout to gather rare and valuable resources. Yet these rewards don't come without risk. Monitor your environment for anything out of the ordinary. Now you know the benefits of using Atomics for Peace. You are completely prepared to responsibly use nuclear weapons. As a hand-picked resident of Vault 76, it is your duty to carefully review your vault tech provided films yearly to fully prepare for the day when you will emerge.